Hey, it's Eric from Grilling and Smoking in the Suburbs. Today I'm going to show you how to light charcoal grill. I got my charcoal here, Kingsford. No preference on the brand, but this is my favorite. I like to stack nice piles. Usually to one side of the grill I'll keep all the charcoal. Then I take my fluid, coat it all up real nice, make sure it all gets wet. Try to let that soak in for about five minutes or so. She's been soaking in about five minutes. Just take your lighter. Light it wherever you can. You really don't have to worry about getting it, the flame everywhere because it will spread eventually on its own. You don't have to use a piece of paper or you don't have to use a, a lighter. You can use a piece of paper or whatever you feel safe with. Now, I know some people are against using fluid altogether, but I assure you, if you start it right and do it correctly, you will have no no problems with the fluid. As long as you let charcoal turn all gray all ashed over before you start cooking. So we're gonna come back in a couple of minutes and I'm gonna show it to you all gray. All right, as you can see, the charcoal is gray. It's been about 15, 20 minutes, this whole process. To help it get gray faster, I keep both the vents open on the grill so it gets full oxygen. Now, just a couple, just a couple of reminder for safety tips that when, uh, when you're lighting your charcoal grill, please don't do it next to buildings. Please don't do it inside your house. But uh, when you're ready to cook, throw your grate on top. Give your grate a little cleaning. And then you're ready to throw your food on there. All right, when you want to control the heat in your grill, both sides or both vents you either keep them open or closed when you keep them open all the way the hotter the grill is going to burn when you keep them closed it's going to control the heat it's going to keep the heat down so you have to get a feel for that as you're cooking depending on what you're cooking with but uh i hope you like my video don't forget to like share and subscribe eric with growing and smoking in the suburbs thank you